Hello once again and welcome to Fallout New Vegas. Today we're going to start our adventures on this game, but we're not going to be playing the New Vegas game, we're going to be playing a mod for New Vegas, which installs alongside the main story, and this is Project Brazil. This was on the Mod DB top 10 list of 2013 in terms of mods, and apparently it's supposed to be very good, so I thought we'd give it a go and see how it is. So, oh shit. Sure. Let's go. Um, I've been wanting to play Fallout for a little while, but I didn't want to do it straight into like normal Fallout, because everybody does that. I've played it loads, I'm bored of it, so I thought I'll install this mod. And from what, I can, from what I've seen, it looks very professional, it looks fucking awesome. Look at this, I'll be quiet for the cutscene. Like, it even feels like Fallout. See, it's even got that zoom out thing. Oh, it's just so good. I love this mod. I love it so far. I'm playing it. But I've seen this trailer part before. This is the trailer. But it's also the introduction. But it looks like Fallout. It could be Fallout 4. If you didn't know it was a mod. Do you know what I mean? Like, the way they've done it. Case part in Los Angeles. The she bank. War. War never changes. Makes a strong man weak. And a poor man. Rich. The difference is decided by character. And if you don't think character is the only factor in deciding victory, then you've been playing the wrong game this whole damn time. The world was playing the wrong game 200 years ago. They learned what it meant to be found faulty in character. For their failure, they became a wasteland of nuclear hellfire. Now out there, there's a horde of men calling themselves survivalists, remnants of the old world, thinking they can get by just on the strength of their arms alone. There's a new California republic, gambling away in the glory of America's past on a legion of slaves trying to rise against their masters on some old forgotten island. None of them have any idea what kind of character it takes to bring the greatest nation on earth back to glory. But down here, in Vault 18, you're gonna learn everything you need to know about winning that war. Right here, right now, on this battlefield. You are the last of America's finest men and women. You're the A-list. The rest of those idiots are a thing of the past. Now is your time. You'll get out there and show that you have the character it takes to bring America back to glory. Can I get a hoorah? Hoorah! Damn right! Now move out! I think that part, the part where he's talking to his kind of football group, that could have been a part where you're actually the player. I don't think it looks very good as a cutscene. Like, the bit before that was fucking awesome. But I think this part right here could have been just like a scene where you look through the character's eyes. Uh, ignore all these pop-ups. It's just like all the DLC packs, all the mods I have. Loads of them are going to come up. <laughs> so it seems like the mods I have active on Fallout New Vegas are actually active on Project Brazil as well. It shouldn't make too much of a difference. It's only like graphics mods. Play, yep, Old World Blues. Yep, I know. I've, I've played it. Yeah, I know that. Uh, yep, sweet. Nice. Cool. 
Alright, come on. Tackle or dodge? Athlete or nerd? So I think what this is, this is uh, Project Brazil's equivalent of the GOAT, which was in uh, Fallout 3, where like you took a test and it determined what kind of stats you had. But instead of taking the GOAT, you either choose to be an athlete or a nerd. I think this is just like the basis of your character. I think you can just totally go in a different direction if you wanted to. But I think that we should go with athlete. For the sole reason that my characters on Fallout normally have a basis on charisma. And I think you know, the athlete will probably have charisma. I think the nerd will be like science, uh, energy weapons maybe. I think the athlete will be like big weapons, hand to hand and charisma. And charisma is something that you need in Fallout. So we'll go with athlete for now. Yeah, because I never hack terminals unless I have to. But I think, like, charisma's the main thing. For me, at least. Alright. That was the best play I've seen in years, kid. The whole vault is singing your praise this season. Looks like Braves Patriots put another trophy on the shelf thanks to you. Now, I've been told you've got a career to look forward to. You made the final touchdown of the season, so that should give you just about any job you want in here. Shame you can't put it to real use out in the wasteland. With a backbone like that, you could do a lot of good up top. Um, Alright, so this is a UI mod. It's not part of Project Brazil, but it's alongside it, so I should probably explain that like it just means that you can scroll. Well, I mean, you don't need to scroll. So it's more PC friendly, so you can just read all of the stuff. Otherwise, it would be like have to scroll for ages. Um, thank you, sir. I'm proud of done it. I had better moments. Johnny's a puss. I'm proud the gym lights didn't knock him over. <laughs> <laughs> Damn right. You know you've always been my star. Player. I was talking to Chevy up in the security department. Those goddamn morons in the overseer's office actually want to put you to work in maintenance. Idiots don't know what kind of attitude you have. How would you like to work for vault security? You mean you don't concede to hope to will of a benevolent and fair corporate overseers from vault -Tec? Hell yeah. Um. Well, shit. I suppose you're a genuine patriot. Oh yes, I'm a big fan of our benevolent vault -Tec overlords. All hail the overseer. Hey kid, before you go, uh, I want to ask you something. You were born in the wasteland, from what I understand. Now, I'm new to this place, and I like to get to know my best players. But I don't know much about you yet. Um, I lived in Volley my whole life. I'm adopted like everyone else. I'm just your average athlete. I don't mean to make you my pal, Brad. Fuck off now. <laughs> Strange. Well, at any rate, you've been raised by your fellow Americans, and that's what matters to me. I'm starting to organize an after-school program for motivated athletes like yourself, and I'd like you to be there. You've picked yourself a bright future, but what if one day that future was threatened? Would you be willing to stand up next to me and fight for your country? I thought you were just a coach. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> what the fuck are you fucking smoking? Uh, yeah, absolutely. What are you talking about? That's my star player. Oh, I don't know what he's talking about. I'm talking about the possibility of this vault falling to the tide of outside forces. I'm talking about the new California Republic, the survivalist super mutants. But it doesn't just stop at the vault door. Few of us believe that the future is inevitable. Not all of us have been calling Vault 18 home for 200 years. We know what's up there, what's coming like it came for the others. But we can't just sit and hide while the powers above storm over this great nation. People like you and I have got to fall in and throw our weight behind an effort to save the America we survived to protect and serve. You understand what I'm saying? Not at all. And... Um. I don't know if you've noticed, but... Oh, shit. Uh, 
Let's just say we understand. I don't fucking understand, Damn but whatever. Right, soldier. I can tell you have a high endurance already, and you have the strength you need to survive in this world. Now listen, I think you have what it takes to be a great leader, but you're going to need above average charisma and a damn fine set of combat skills. I want you to go check out that bigger tester on the wall over there, and if you score right, I'm going to put you at the top of my A list. Give me a shout, will you? Alright, so it's like the Vigor Tester at the start of Fallout New Vegas. And it kind of d determines your skills. It's like the specials on Fallout 3, but um, I, I knew it would have to have Christmas, so that's the right choice. Can we take this? Yeah, I want a Steeler. How many does he have? He's got loads. He has got fucking loads. They're all the same, though. So, how did it turn out? There we are. Damn fine work. But we already knew that. What else does it say? Alright, well, let's just tell them the stuff that we already knew. Uh, it says I'm right for leadership and I have a good mannerism. Hmm, so it does. That's definitely a key factor. And? Endurance. That's all it says, mate. <laughs> I don't know what you want. Get that score, kid. Shit. Maybe you're not as fit as I thought. Go on and get out of my office. Do some push-ups for God's sake. How fucking dare you, right? Fuck you. I did your turn. I did your cunty test, right? Why did you do that? Oh fuck. It's a bit of an overreaction. <laughs> Run. There's a madman after us. Run. I've, I've totally fucked up. I've totally fucked up. Hello. Hello. Hey, great job out there tonight. <laughs> ah! So, since we won the game of the year, how should we celebrate? I don't know, by not getting fucking shot at by some crazy coach. Fuck's sake. Oh yeah, sex. I would if I could. I would if I could. I would if I fucking could. I don't know what's going on, like. <laughs> I've totally fucked up this. Hey, there she is. Vault 18's tomboy warrior. Say, uh, do you have time for a little girl talk before you turn in? I'm a dude. I'm a guy. Wow, <laughs> we're yeah. off to a really hot start. Come to my room later, cutie. I have some post-game questions I'd like to throw at you. Alright, I'll meet you back at my place, sweet cheeks. What the fuck is this mod? Am I a guy or a woman? I'm a woman, ah. Oh, well, now I'm a fucking dead guy. Now I'm a fucking dead person. So it doesn't really make much difference. How the fuck am I a woman? I mean, a guy. <laughs> Go after load. Go after load back. I don't know what I did, but I fucked up. Fuck off, Megan. You want to waste my time? I want to waste your life. Get out of here. Well, he's changed attitude quickly, hasn't he? That's it. A la di da, la di da, la di da 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 da, a la di da. What are you gonna do about it, Cutlugs? La di da 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 da. It's a bit of an overreaction. Bit of an overreaction, right? I hate that coach so much. I got good charisma, good strength, right? So why is he so much of a dick? Can we use our charisma to talk him into killing himself? That's our thing. What items do I have? Right, oh, we can kill him. I didn't know he had these weapons. Oh, you know what this means. Coach! Time for some fun. Nice! He's unconscious. Hey, there she is. Fault 18's tomboy warrior. Say, uh, do you have time for a little girl talk before you turn in? I'm a little busy, if I'm honest. <laughs> uh, a bit of blood on my screen. Yeah, sure. Wow, we're off to a really hot start. Yep. Alright, see you there. Alright. 
to have some sexy time. Is it worse than our first period? So we are a woman. I didn't remember making a woman, but oh well. We'll we'll deal with it. Just uh, have some tea bargain. All right, nice. All right, well he's a cunt, so we're not going to stay with him. I'm just going to uh, unequip the armor because it gets on my nerves a bit. Uh, no, there's also bullet time. I forgot to mention. Won the game of the year. Like you can do bullet time, it slows it down, which is sort of like uh, VATS, but to a lesser extent. Does VATS actually pause this time? What's up? Goodbye. <laughs> All right, so we, I think we should call that woman straight away. The other girl. Uh, data. Local map. Quests. How do I drill? Uh, and you can also sprint now as well, which is helpful. Hey, congratulations on the big win, player. Great work out there. That was some sick footwork knocking over Johnny Matheson. Guy didn't stand a chance. You're a bruiser. Yeah, thanks. You're a member of the team too. Thanks for having me back. Whoa, thanks, hun. You always make me feel like I'm part of the team. You're the best. Mwah. Cause I like you. <laughs> Hope you don't mind. What the fuck? Are all the people in this vault lesbians? Because we're, we're on our way. We're literally on our way to fuck the other person while she's saying she likes us. Like, what the hell? Is there something in the water? I don't know what this mod is like. It's fucking weird. I mean, like, mod DB's top 10 list. I don't know why this is on there. They must have some weird fetishes. Um, I, I, I like you a lot too. Always have. Really? Wow. Um, I'd like to hear more about that. I'm... You know, not usually the girl people choose to pick to like because of, well, stuff. You know, drama. Is that true? Yeah, I know the rumors. I don't give a shit. I think it's cool. Whoa. Do, do you really mean that? Speech 50 or charisma 7. Um, if you found somebody you loved, you should hold on to it. Nobody's been doing it for you. Hey, Eric's not even here. You may be better off with someone who's in who you are, like me. So it doesn't make a difference, because we can use both of those. Oh. So you really think I'm worth that? Even after everything else? Well, sure, I... I'll have to tell Eric that you're right. Even though you're a... No, it doesn't matter what you are. Boy or girl, rich vault kid or a poor wastelander. You think I'm worth it. If we are meant to be, it's worth that chance. No matter what happens. I'll see you tonight, okay? I've... I've got to take care of something. Alright, we'll just wait while I go lick this girl's pussy and I'll come back for you. <laughs> I don't know what this mod is. I don't know what I am playing. After this took part in Los Angeles, right? And you had to take down slavers. Because in the in the like description it said there's like a slaver faction. There's like a faction of like clever people from San Francisco. But no, it's just having sex with women. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what this is. I might as well be in fucking rapture. God's sake, man, this is so weird. I, I've literally knocked out my coach because he was a cunt. And then I've started having sex with people. I guess that's how you celebrate in the vault. This is proper strange. 